All right, it's time for a hot, oh, I like the shoe cam. Oh, hey, shoe cam, how are you? All right, hey, Kenzie Swanhart. Hey, what do you say we cook waffles vertically? What do you think? Well, it's Ninja Kitchen Month on QVC, and so mm -hmm. we're super excited about that. This is Kinsey Swanhart. She is the director of the Ninja Test Kitchen. Next to my job, she probably has the next best job in the whole world. Definitely one of the tastiest. Nice to see you. <laughs> and this is a waffle maker that the last time we had it on the air sold out completely. Yes. Now, it's not like any regular waffle iron you've used before because, look, it's vertical. As you look at these waffle irons, you're like, wait, shouldn't that be resting wait on its side? <laughs> no. You're going to fill it from the top, mm -hmm. and then in no time at all, Check you're going to have a beautiful waffle inside, and you can control the shade, the darkness. You can. You can. So here we've got our first waffle. This is just our classic waffle recipe. Of course, you can also use, um, if you would prefer, you know, your whatever mix you like to use. You don't have How to use ours. Out of there. Check that out. So easily. We've got this amazing non-stick, but I want to show you how easy it is to use because of course, you know, we had to do things a little different to make it easier for you when you're making waffles at home. So we made it vertical with this easy to fill spout. And we, we include a measuring cup. Yep, we include this special measuring cup. You're going to fill it right to the line. And then all you do, let me see if I can get a nice angle there for you, is fill it up. And it's non-stick all the way to the top. So if you, you know, overfill it a little bit, no worries. That's what I call a chef snack. You know, you cut the tail off, you give the people the perfect waffle, and you but get you to enjoy to that little snack. But you want to use the measuring cup yep. and fill the cup completely and there then you know. pop it in there. Yep. And then this dial will let you know your level of, or your shade, your, your level shade. of doneness, right? So you go all the way from one, two, three, four, five. And David, of course I have to show you that level of oh, look at you, of fancy. Doneness. So here we've got level one all the way through. Here, let's show level you. And we'll get uh, over top this so you can really appreciate it. This is level one. Mm -hmm. So it's a lighter, more cakey yes, type exactly. waffle. Yes, exactly. Two, three, four, and extra crispy is five. I mean, come on. And none of them are super dark. No. They're just yeah. cooking a little longer so they're not as soft or they might be a little more crispy. Exactly, exactly. The perfect doneness every time. But we also have a specialty shade. So these are, of course, when you're cooking, uh, you know, your regular waffle or pancake um, or waffle mix. But if you're doing a specialty waffle like I did here, I did banana bread. Oh, yum. Right? How fun is that? A little banana bread waffle. Gonna go ahead and, and just pick that up. super soft. Look at that. Look at that. Absolutely and then delicious. maybe top it with some bananas and some bananas foster sauce. What do you sauce. think? Maybe. I mean, how special for the holidays, right? We're all thinking of, you know, what am I going to be using to celebrate with my friends and family? If you have folks over overnight, there you go. And then you just top it with a little. Oh, wait, we got a jumper. Oh, pardon my face. There we go. No, thank there we go. you. And then, of course, that maple syrup, and you want to get it in every nook and cranny. Well, that's the beautiful part of a Belgian waffle because all those little uh, those little pockets there, fill yeah. them full of butter and syrup Ooh. and bananas and all kinds of yumminess. I need to let you know that this sold out the last day it was on the air and it was way back in November of last year. Yeah. So it's almost I been a year. I was still here. Oh, I know <laughs> you were. Baby. baby number two wasn't here yet. <laughs> and this is $89.99 at retail. We've got it at $69.98 tonight. Now, it's a special sale price. Now, before that video, can we take a quick look at colors? Now, this is the gray. We'll come in nice and close. This is the gray. Beside it is the black. Then I have cinnamon. Cinnamon, very, very popular. Mm -hmm. And then we have it in white. You have everything, including your measuring cup and your recipe booklet. You can do chocolate waffles, banana bread waffles, regular type waffles, yep. whatever you love, right? Cake batter waffles. Oh, cake batter waffles. I mean. Maybe with extra sprinkles for the birthday, <laughs> maybe. Yeah. Maybe. All right, now these are very popular. Talk to us about what we're seeing here. So here what you're seeing is you're turning from shade one to five. It'll be red when it's heating up and green when it's ready to go. Super, super simple. You're going to fill your cup, fill your waffle maker, and then that is literally it. It'll start cooking when it's ready to go. When it's done, it'll turn green again, and you can go pull out your waffle. And I mean, how simple. It's just going to go between red and green so you know cook, when you're cook, ready. Cook, 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 I mean, cook, cook. Right? It's so, so easy. easy. It does all the work for mm -hmm. you. It does all the heavy lifting. And nothing sticks because these no, plates are non-stick. It is non-stick. So even if you do get a little like leftover, easy, easy wet cloth to clean it up. Chef so, snack. so simple. Mm -hmm. Chef snack. That's what I call it. <laughs> right? What do you have in here? So here we did a little cinnamon apple 
kind of pancake. So we've got a little spice in there. We're gonna go ahead and pull that waffle out. Cinnamon, apple, Perfect. spice, and everything nice. And then of oh, course, my word. it's you know all about the perfect even Nicely done waffle adds your favorite topping. So here we've got some apple slices. Yum. We've got some walnuts. May I do the honors? Oh, please do. And then some fresh caramel sauce. Is that what this is? Yep, of course. See, here, go ahead and grab David, that. I always, grab that. mine always go tumbling here. Not too There worry. we go. I mean, you got children delicious. at home. You're just lucky to get a hot <laughs> meal on the table. I know. Look at that. I mean, delicious. Now, there you go. Come on now. You are making waffles like nobody's business, and you're filling it everything from the top vertically. We give you the measuring cup. Mm -hmm. The only rule is make sure that measuring cup is filled to the brim and you empty all of it into the waffle maker. Exactly. And remember, it's so, so simple. So if you look right on the front, you see it's a green uh, light. That means we're ready to go. So red, it's heating up. You wait until it's green, and then you know you're ready to go. You're going to fill it all the way. I love this. And this is another one of those apple cinnamon waffles. Yep. Mm -hmm. Apple cinnamon. So, so simple. What? How fun, and you've right? Got this, and on... this is on specialty, right? Yes, it is. Yeah. So uh, if you're doing one of those fun mixes, that's when you use specialty. Mm. Like if you're doing, you know, getting creative there. And when you use your classic mixes, that's when you decide now, by this shade. one turned green. Does that mean it's done? Mm -hmm. Just as we were chatting. Now this is the one that we that we filled early mm -hmm. on in the presentation. Now you're wondering about that little extra piece on the top. Well, that's a snack. That's a chef snack. That's just for you to enjoy while everybody else is making their way to the dinner table. Look at that. Putting their phones down and coming to the dinner table. Come to the dinner <laughs> table. I, a funny story. A um, few years ago, I was home at Christmas time, mm -hmm. and uh, my brother, sister, and I were there, and my brother's two children were there on their Ooh, phones. Of course. of course. And mom came out of the kitchen. She said. Dinner's ready. Now, my brother and sister and I were at different parts of the house. Like Pavlov's dog, we reported to the <laughs> dinner table. And my niece and nephew were over at the, uh, in the living room, still mm -hmm. in their phones. I stepped in the living room and I said, you weren't raised by your nana. Oh. I was. Dinner table means now. Yeah. Dinner's and ready. she won't call you twice. <laughs> and they went, uh-huh. I said, I mean it. Put those phones down. And they came right to the dinner table. So this is what it's all about. Mm -hmm. Everybody is looking to create something magical, but you want to do it in record time. We're yes. going to help you do it in record time. How many are gone now, Brian? Over 950 wow. are gone. But you oh, know what amazing. is flying out the door? Which color? Cinnamon. Cinnamon. I mean, it's gorgeous. Or as I, when I was a little boy, I called it cinnamon. <laughs> cinnamon <laughs> is flying out the door. So if you want cinnamon, I have 850 left. I remember oh, this wow, sold out last go. November. Yeah. And it was a, it's been a whole year since we've, almost a whole year yeah. since we've had it back in stock. So let me review all the colors. Here's white. Here's the very popular cinnamon. Cinnamon. <laughs> uh, here's the black. I have the gray. You will get a recipe booklet that Kinsey had a lot to do with. Mm -hmm. And this measuring cup. That measuring cup is worth its weight in gold. Yes. You always want to use our measuring cup. And then again, that recipe book has all of these fun specialty waffles. This is the cake waffle that I was telling you about, uh, David. Oh, Ooh, look! A little surprise. So what I love is that you can, you know, start a fun family tradition here. So we've got our cake waffle. Of course, David did a beautiful job at mm. making like a Not this David, yeah. Chef David. We <laughs> Chef have a stylist David. named David, and he's marvelous. I and mean, this how is fun. a s'more waffle mm -hmm, stack. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, s'mores oh, waffles. Those, those marshmallows. Wouldn't this be a fun, like, you know, kind of holiday tradition to start? And what mm -hmm. I love, David, is it's so, so simple. Red, green, you know when to go. You just push a button to pull them out, and you can do this while the kids are running around. And would Did this it be a specialty green? waffle oh, again? Yep. All right, so red means it's, it means it's, means heating, it's up. heating up. When that red button turns to green, that means it's heated up. I can add mm -hmm. my batter. Yeah. And then when it'll turn red again, I'm guessing. Yep, when it's cooking. And then when it turns green, it means it's done. Ready for you. Oh, I'm And ready. of course, the ninja beep. You will hear ready. the happy beep, and you will know that it is time. Is this a red velvet waffle? It is a red velvet waffle. Oh. Ooh. How They're standing up today. Oh, look at there that. we go. <laughs> You're wondering, are these going to stick to my waffle mat? That was so non-stick, it, it nearely fell out it and jumped right on the plate. Out. <laughs> yeah. Look at this. I mean, how fun. And actually, could you pass me that, um, of course. that plate right there? And are, is that a cream cheese frosting? Yes, because oh, when we my do a heavens. red velvet waffle, we do it correctly with a little Boys cream and girls, cheese girlfriend frosting. girlfriend has a red velvet <laughs> waffle with cream cheese ice. Does it get better? I mean, I don't think it does. I don't think it does either. And if you wanted to do a cream cheese compound butter. Oh, that would be delicious. I mean, just whip some butter into that. Use your KitchenAid hand mixture that we had yep. last week as today's special value. Maybe a little powder 
powdered sugar on top. Uh huh. Uh huh. Make it a little sweeter. Mm, come on. Maybe use a sugar substitute <laughs> and bust it out. Um, this is phenomenal. Now, coming up a little later, we have Corky's chicken mm -hmm. tenders. You How took fun. the tenders and got a little wacky, didn't you? Yeah, because waffles are not just for breakfast. I mean, chicken and waffles can be for breakfast, but it makes a darn good dinner, too. Okay, so here <laughs> are the chicken tenders with waffle buns. So mm -hmm. good. Now, if you wanted to douse that with buffalo sauce and make those buffalo sandwiches. Ooh, there you go. Not even kidding. All right, we're getting a lot of questions about how to clean it. What would oh, you Oh, so suggest? simple. Okay, so you're going to use a damp cloth. Mm -hmm. to do the outside. Let it cool? You let it cool down first. Yes, you definitely want to let it cool down. It gets really hot. And then inside, same thing. Just a damp well, cloth. And you want it to be hot because yeah. if it weren't not, if it were not hot, all the batter would run out of the bottom, exactly. right? Exactly. Because as soon as you dump that batter in the top, it starts cooking. Mm -hmm. It starts cooking immediately. It does. And actually, I'm going to go ahead and start another one right here with all our cake batter. Oh, because it were batter. preheated. Oh, yeah. look at you, fancy. I mean, how easy? I'm just thinking, like, you know, when my son turns one, it's a, it's a big deal, right? It's the first birthday. Plus, how your fun hands to start are going to be full because you have two children and a husband. Do you have any pets? Mm -hmm. Oh, two, two dogs. Yeah, okay. They're well so fed, So she's by got the a way. lot of little ones at her house. <laughs> All right. Yeah. And but, I can I mean, manage both, both this. literal and figural. <laughs> All right. Uh, this is extraordinary. So now waffles are easy for you, Mom. So easy. Think about like holidays. Everyone's running around. You know, you want to be celebrating with everybody under that tree. What if now on a day when you've got a little time to play, you make waffles, freeze, freeze them. Freeze them, yes. And then pop them in the microwave before you serve. Yeah, right? Done. Pop them on the All right, sheet pan. Let's review colors again. Yeah. Now, I have white, but if you want cinnamon, I have fewer than 500 left. 1,500 ordered in this show. I have 500 cinnamon left. Here's the black. Here's the gray. There's your measuring cup and your recipe and instructional booklet. So all that is coming together. Kenzie, it's so good to see you. So good to see you. Thank you. Give the little ones a hug for us. Oh, I will. David, my daughter goes, who on TV with you? I said, that's Uncle David. She goes, say hi, Uncle David. So hi uh, from that Oh, <laughs> Tell her, I said, give her a big hug for me. I will, I will. This is fantastic. We are super, super busy. Only order of the year and sold out the last time of the year. Good yeah. to see you, friend. So good to see you. Thank you. All right. Now, it's time. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to scooch in front of you here. And we're going to get ready for COPCO. It's all about kitchen organization. But you'll have that 